Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Shayla, if this is your first time here. So in today's video, I'm gonna be reviewing the brand new Becky G times ColourPop collab. I know this is the year of collabs, like they're dropping like hotcakes. Okay, but this one has definitely caught my attention. It's just, it, you guys are gonna love it. Okay, my first impression of the collection was like, oh, okay, she knows how to put some colors together, okay. Let me show you guys the PR package. This is it, look at how cute this is. Wait, let me open it up and show you and really show you, look at, there's a shot glass right here. Okay, this is a palette and then Patron. <laughs> I like free alcohol, okay. Okay, and then the bottom you have the two highlighters and the lips, but I just love, I just love it. I'm here for it. I'm vibing with this collection and I'm so excited for Becky G. I don't know her, okay? I met her before and she seems super sweet. I like her music, okay? I went to Cali Bash and I believe she was there. I'm pretty like 95% sure she was there and it was popping, okay? All right, so let's just jump right into the collab. Let's start with the eyeshadow palette. Okay, so I know in English, this is Savage. In Spanish, we will say Salviaje. I don't know how to pronounce it, okay, but it, it means Savage. <laughs> and it has a little signature right here. When you open it up, look at how pretty that is, like. Uh. So uh, this, like these warm browns, this color actually blends right into my skin tone. These are just like, this is like me. You know, these are colors that I like to wear. I can wear every single one of these colors. Like these two transition colors are just, this is like my vibe, you know, like this is, this was made for me. So the palette comes with the names on it, a mirror, which we like that, and it's nice and small. Um, we like a small palette, don't we? You know, you could travel with it. Uh, I don't want a ginormous palette. I want something that I could just like throw in my makeup bag and call it a day. All right, Becky G is also launching two highlighters. One of them is more of like a gold. One of them has like a pink iridescence. I will try these on in the video, but it has a signature. The packaging is just super cute. Like, I have no complaints. I just love this. These are my colors. These are the colors I love. All right, not only is she launching the eyeshadow palette and the two highlighters, which already, this is looking like A+. Okay, she's coming out with five liquid lipsticks. Two of them are matte, the other three are satin, and they're all like warm. Like, ooh, look at this orange, like, you guys. <laughs> this is just like, these are colors I like to wear. I love these warm colors. Um, you can see that the packaging has um, like the same design as the PR package and it's green. I just think that, you know, you could really tell that she, I want to say put her elbow, in, what's the expression? She really put her elbow into it, you know, that expression. I think it's like an old school expression, but you could tell she really took her time with this palette and put some colors together that she thought would be poppin' and bangers and she just did a good job, okay? I love this. Um, so quick little story, I was gonna film a different video today and Les comes home and I just I was like, let me just go downstairs and say hi to him. And when I went down, he's like, oh yeah, you got something from ColourPop. And I knew, I was like, oh, and I opened it and I was like, ooh, we filming with this. Okay, we filming with this. We quick with the upload, with the new product launches. <laughs> all right, so in this video, you guys will see me apply all the products and I'll let you know my final thoughts at the end. So let's just get started. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding <laughs> just kidding let me show you guys the shot glass because i realized i didn't show you earlier but look at how cute this is i love it oh oh my god i thought that was like a spider that's just the packaging <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> i'm gonna have this um maybe the weekend i don't know it's a tuesday and you know i can't be drinking during the week but i'm gonna save this for later all right, we are gonna start with Lola, this one in the crease. See how this looks, I love this peachy like tangerine color, it's so nice. And I put concealer on my eyes. No eyeshadow base, I just throw on some concealer up in there. We love a warm crease, yes we do. This is the type of color you wear by itself, all over the lid, the crease, call it a day, lashes, for like that everyday look, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so Malbec and Sangria are kind of similar. This is a little bit more red. What to do, what 
to do. Let's put a little bit of sangria in the crease because I typically don't use reds in the crease that often. So, you know, we can't be doing the same thing all the time. Let's see here. Mm -hmm. Just gonna apply this back and forth using my Sigma E40 brush. Ooh, it looks like a little sunrise on my on my eyeballs. This palette actually reminds me of like a sunrise with the beach, the water. Like, look, you got a little bit of everything. Sunrise up in here, you got the water, you know, you got some gold sand, you got a little sunburn right here. <laughs> so I'm really just building this color up until like I get the look that I want. I always start with like a little bit and then gradually add more and just really build it. Ooh, yes. All right, I'm a little curious about Cafecito, this one right here. So we're gonna put a little bit of this in the outer corner of the eye. I just wanna see if it shows up. So I do want the outer corner to be like a little darker. Oh yeah, it does. We're just gonna put this right up in here. And I did switch to a smaller, this is a 231 brush from Zoeva. This is in the outer corner. Yes, yes, yes. Little drama up in here. This color is actually getting really dark. I didn't think it was gonna show up this dark. Ah, I like it. That was this one, Cafecito. Cafecito. Cafecito? I don't know. One of them. One of them. All right, I'm gonna put a little bit of sangria on the outside of the lid. Just right up in here. I'm really liking the sangria color a lot. Look at it, a lot to look. I think I'm gonna do, okay. So next I'm gonna go in with Estrella and Celosa and put these on the lid. So light to dark kind of starting here and then going that way. This is Estrella. All right, now I'm gonna go in with Celosa. And I'm just gonna use the other side of the brush. Oh, Ooh, this actually looks so pretty with sangria. Oh yeah. Oh, I like this. Ooh, I love Celosa right here. Mm -hmm. All right, using a pencil brush, I'm gonna smudge Sangria under my lash line. Sangria is like my favorite, okay. I'm also gonna put just a little bit of Cafecito, this one, um, on the outer corner on the bottom lash line, just so it kind of like, you know, goes with the top part of my eye. I knew I would like this palette. Wing or no wing, wing or no wing. Let's wing it. Okay, we gonna wing it. I just convinced myself to wing it. I was like, mm, I'm not about to wing this liner. And then I was like, nah, we about to wing it. <laughs> this is a shady liner from Dosa Colors. And it's a black liner. You could also do like a purple or like a reddish brown, a reddish color. Any of those would look super cute. I don't know why, but I've been liking like the no wing look lately. Little wing wing. Okay, this is super cute, okay? Like, look at that, look at that, look at that. All right, I'm gonna use, oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna wait, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna wait to put the lashes and mascara on because I wanna set my face first and I wanna set my face after uh, the highlighter. Ooh, I almost forgot. All right, so just because I know you guys wanna see what these look like, I'm just gonna put one uh, Princessa on this side and chiz me on this side. All right, Princessa. Mm -hmm. I feel like these actually would look super cute mixed together. This is almost like a pink, like an iridescent pink uh, highlight. All right, this is Chisum. Chisum. Chiz me. I don't know. Oh, yeah, that's cute. All right, I'm gonna mix them now because I want a little bit of pink on this side. Need to be even, can't be looking crazy. I'm gonna add a little bit of Sweetest Cocoa Blush just to kind of blend out the highlight with the contour. That highlight was, you know, it was real popping. It was like, oh, we are bright popping. Oh, use highlight, highlight popping. All right, I'm gonna set my makeup with the Urban Decay All Nighter Spray. Look at that little sunrise on my on my eyeballs. All right, now time for mascara. This is Snapscara from Maybelline. I've been really liking this one. And I'm gonna do false lashes. All right, I'm gonna finish off my little tequila sunrise with MILF lashes from Lily Lash. Little tequila sunrise. Patron sunrise, I don't know. So I winged my liner, which is why I chose a lash that kind of has a little bit of a wing at the end, you see that? I feel like a lot of these brands have been like really bringing the heat lately, you know? 
Like the last few reviews I did, I was like, ooh, like I really like the palettes. Like I really love this one. I like this collab actually, just in general. Can't stop looking at my eyes. Ooh, I almost forgot to <laughs> highlight my nose. I'm gonna put Princessa, the iridescent kind of, you guys can see it's like an iridescent pink. Put a little bit on my nose. Ooh, I never highlight with like rose gold or pink. So I was like, let's just try it. That's actually kind of nice. And you guys can see I highlight up here and then I kind of leave this blank and then highlight here. A little bit here too. Oh, <laughs> she's putting it all over, put a little bit on her chin too. Oh yeah, that's cute, a little pink drip. Becky G drip. Drip, drip, drip. Salvia, hey, I like you. I can't pronounce you, but I like you. All right, y'all, are you ready for some lips? So I'm gonna put the lip liners on off camera and I'm gonna put the lipstick on on camera so you guys can see all the colors. I'm gonna try them all on. Let's start with Besame. Besame. This is Anger Mood from Linda Hallberg Cosmetics. I know, I was like, I'm gonna put lips on off camera. Hmm. And then Besame. So this is a matte lipstick. Besame. All right, I lined with KKW Nude 2 and we're gonna apply Flor. This is like a orangey terracotta color. It's an ultra matte lip. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. I like knew I was like, all these colors about to look good. I would do this with like just a neutral eye, like a really natural eye or like a, yeah, just like a really natural eye and let the lip do the talking. Ooh, I like this a lot though. Flor. All right, what's up next? Ooh, we have Chola. Ooh. All right, let's put these Chola lips on. This is a satin lip, right? Yep. Ooh, I like Chola. Yes. This is, okay, this is definitely a brown, but it kind of has like a berry undertone to it. Ooh, I like Chola a lot. <laughs> yes, we do. Mm -hmm. This is another lip that I would do with just like lashes and maybe a wing liner. I love wearing browns like this. Um, they just like, they like complement the skin. It's nice. Okay, yes. All right, this next color is Miha. Oh, Miha. This is the lightest of the collection and this is also a satin lip. Mm. Hmm. Ooh, you see what I did there? You put it on the bottom, blot it until it blends. <laughs> Add a little more liner. Oh, I might have to put this color back on. Miha is nice. Yes, we like her a lot. See, I this collection is just, like she got it, she got it right. You know, like she got it right. All right, the last color from the collection is called Secreto. Secreto? Secreto? Secreto. I think that was it, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. This is like a light terracotta color. I love these tones, like, she did really good. Ooh. You know what I really like about these lip colors? I feel like they're different. Like this isn't what's typically launched with collabs and I appreciate that. Like, I like all of these. <laughs> I think I'm gonna put Miha back on though. All right guys, here is the finished look. I put Miha back on because I just love it so much. Um, I think this was just a really well put together collection a well put together collab. I am so happy for Becky G. I just think this is beautiful. I love it. The only product that I think I probably won't wear, like I like this pink highlight, but I think the other highlight, what is it? The Chisholm, Chismi? I don't know, the one that I put I think on this side first, it was like a little too bright. I probably won't wear that as much as I wear Princessa. Yeah, she cute, but honestly, like everything looked amazing. And I think you guys are gonna like this one a lot. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I was really excited when I got the package a couple hours ago and I couldn't wait to film with it. I'm so happy it left up to the expectations and don't forget to comment below, subscribe to my channel, and last but not least, Shred and Slay. Cute. Is the light even behind me? What's gonna happen up in here? Let me put it in, wait, 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 wait. No, it isn't. All right, so the moment. Oh my gosh. Hold on, let me switch brushes real quick. Hmm. Oh my God, it was like the whole time. Mm-hmm. All right, Becky is also 
Mm. Hmm. I knew it. So I winged my lash. All right, let's just jump right into the product. So the first 